Complete Global Regeneration. One Community Weekly Progress Update, number 82. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do it yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution creating models in the service of all life on this planet. This includes highest good approaches to food, energy, housing, education, for profit and non profit business creation, society, and true earth stewardship. We are creating all these things to be implementable as either individual components or as complete teacher demonstration villages and hubs. Welcome to the One Community Weekly Progress Update. My name is Jay Sable and I'm the Executive Director of the One Community 501c3 nonprofit organization. This is our Weekly Progress Update number 82, September 26th, 2014 edition. As always, I'm going to be covering with pictures and video all of our team's accomplishments and achievements for the last week. And if you'd like to see more details, more specifics, more pictures, and links to all the open source content, everything that we're creating, uh, visit our written blog. Also, if you'd like to receive an email every time one of these updates comes up, uh, comes out, you can send an email to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com, and we will add you to our newsletter list. Let's jump into the updates. One community's approach to highest good education is open source and free shared, Designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, a learner-teacher collaborative, and it includes California state education standards. This week, the core team, which consists of the Satellite and Pioneer members, finished another 25% of the Signs Lesson Plan Mind Map, which you can see here. This brings us to 75% completion of this mind map for the lesson plan that goes with it and teaches all subjects to all learning levels in the context of signs and symbolism. We're now working on the web page. We also created the foundations of the 30 plus other lesson plan pages that you can see linked to here. General formatting for all these pages is now complete in the site so that we can more easily input the content as we finish it. Behind the scenes, we also finished a rewrite of the signs lesson plan in preparation for the web page and the first 10 percent of the lesson plan design with the central theme of love. If you'd like to help with this education program we are seeking people to finish these lesson plans. We've got them all outlined and we're just looking for the creative minds who would like to contribute something amazing to the educational world through our open source and free shared education program for all ages and all educational levels. One community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative, and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. This week the core team working on highest good food finished two more complete breakout pages from the large scale gardening page. These include the carrot page with all the featured carrots and details you see here, plus this coal crops page. This new format is designed to load faster and give us the space to add recipes, gardening tips, harvesting and canning tips, videos, and more. In this area of our open source project, we are seeking permaculturalists, an irrigation specialist, a surveyor, and a chef to join our team as either consultants to the project or pioneers who will be moving onto the property with us. The one community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. This week the core team working on highest good housing finished adding shelving, lights, and countertop details to the upcoming crowdfunding campaign laundry, bathroom, and kitchen dome. We also finished enough of the electrical planning specifics for this campaign to begin putting together the beginnings of the Earthbag Construction Dome Home Energy Infrastructure webpage, which you can see here. And in addition to that, we finished adding the energy rollout and phase-in details for the landing party of the village construction team. The landing party, from a complete global regeneration standpoint, is the initial team of 10 to 20 people who will be able to use the open source details we're creating, and you can see here, to land anywhere in the world, set up power, and prepare to build a highest good and global stewardship self-replicating teacher demonstration hub. 
We also finished another 30% of the Murphy bed wall, changing area and storage component image that you can see here. Uh, this brings us to 70% complete with these parts overview images and plans for the custom furniture designs by Philip Gill for the complete Earthbag Village domes. In this area of the project, we are seeking a master plumber and a master electrician. If you or someone you know would like to help with this component of our open source creation process. One community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. This week, the core team working on the Duplicable City Center completed another long series of 3D design updates, including swapping doors, adding railings and the AC units that you see here, extending storage areas, and adding trees. Behind the scenes, we also finished the rest of the property-wide hydronic setup details that you can see here. And uh, this is our Google Doc in progress, and we're now ready to start building this information onto the website. For this area of the project, we are seeking a structural engineer and a general contractor. The structural engineer is somebody that we're seeking to help us design the cupola so it can be built without a crane, which is very important for our open source goals and duplication anywhere in the world. And the general contractor is needed for assistance in conjunction and collaboration with P2S Engineering, who is helping us with the mechanical, electrical, and plumbing section of this structure. The one community approach to highest good society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet. This week the core team updated and featured our open source conflict resolution policy and process, which you can see here. This conflict resolution process works in conjunction with one community's consensus trainings, feedback format, and conscious and conscientious language skills components. In this area of the project, we're seeking graphic designers, web designers, and technology specialists, videographers, and building a highest good legal team. If you or someone you know fits these descriptions and would like to join our highest good society creation process. One community is here to facilitate complete global regeneration. But to do that, we need to write a new human story. And our idea is to do that through teacher demonstration hubs that are creating for the highest good of all life on this planet. Thinking with the consciousness for the highest good of all, thinking globally and creating solutions that we share with others and teach others how to create additional solutions that they share as well. We call these solution models that create additional solution creating models. And specifically, that is what the teacher demonstration hub is all about. One community is open sourcing the foundations of these teacher demonstration hubs, which are food, energy, housing, education, for-profit, non-profit business creation, recreation models, and true earth stewardship. Putting all of these components together so that they can create a complete hub of education that teaches others how to create hubs as well. And our idea is that if we make it easy enough, if we make it affordable enough, and if we demonstrate it as attractive enough, this idea of complete global regeneration will be kick-started because we'll be writing a new human story. We'll be creating something that will spread on its own. This idea has the potential to transform life on this planet for everyone and everything. And this is why we're so focused on it. And our idea is that if we create for the highest good of all, and we open source and we free share everything that we do, and we design it, we don't just open source it, but we open source project launch blueprint it, which means that we create everything that we create so it can not only be duplicated, but so it's specifically designed to spawn, to generate, to create additional iterations of itself. So that everything that we do can be put together as the complete teacher demonstration hub that I described, or it can be duplicated individually as individual components that can be implemented in people's backyards, or in people's local communities, or in people's local in their cities, and their neighborhoods, things like that. This is what we're all about. This is why we're open source and free sharing everything, and this is why we are a solution organization. So if this sounds fun to you, if this sounds interesting to you, if this sounds like something that you'd like to participate in, we invite you to join us. What we're creating is only limited by the number of people participating. 
Our team has put in tens of thousands of hours into the creative process. We've clearly identified the path. We have detailed out the plan. Every step of what it is that we're creating has been docu documented meticulously and detailed out meticulously and planned out meticulously so that we have a clear path, a clear vision for where it is that we're going, and we're designing it in such a way that if people disagree with us, people think we're crazy, if people want to do it differently, if people would like to create something totally uniquely different from what it is that we're doing, but build off of what it is that we've created, we're here to help do that too. And so our invitation is for people to participate, for people to get involved, to either take our information, use it the way that you want, or to join our pioneer team, which is the team that will move on to the property and actually build one community, to join our satellite member team, which are the team members that operate behind the scenes with us, that they're part of our weekly calls, that are part of our back office, that are collaborating every week with us in a hands-on fashion, uh, or to join our consultant partner team, which are the people that are just donating their time and helping on the outskirts but aren't participating on the same level and intensity of our members and our pioneer members. Or just share our information. You know, everything that we're doing is really about getting the idea out there and sharing it so that this idea of complete global regeneration, the concept, the human story that could be written from these blueprints starts to get into the minds of as many people as possible so that more and more people see what it is that we're creating and understand that they can participate, take the information, that they can take control of their own house building, they can take control of their own food production, they can take control of their own sufficient self-sufficient energy production, education models, recreation models, all of these things are designed to be implemented either individually or as the complete model. And so sharing our information is massively helpful. And to make that easy, we are on all of the social media networks. We are on Facebook. We are on Twitter. We are on LinkedIn. We are on Pinterest. We are on Reddit. We are on Tumblr. We are on all the different social media networks. In some cases, we have several different accounts set up for like on Facebook and on LinkedIn so that people can participate in the way that they want, either following all of our posts or just our updates. And so sharing our information, putting the information out there so that other people see what it is that we're creating or sharing the open source resources with the people that are interested in this information is massively helpful too. And of course, the biggest thing that we're looking for right now is large-scale funding. And none of our team is paid. We're all nonprofit volunteers uh, giving our time to this altruistic venture because we know it's what needs to happen, because we know that complete global regeneration is possible, because we know that if we're to rewrite the human story, if we're going to create a new path, the best way to predict the future is to create it. And so we are being the change that we want to see, and... For those that, that love what it is that we're doing, we're looking for that individual investor, investor, that small group that would like to invest in one community or donate to our 501c3 and help us get the property off the market. That's the number one thing that we need to do right now that would forward our project would be to be able to take that property off the market so we can disclose the location, so we can go on the ground and do the surveys and things that, are, that we're waiting to do until we have that property completely secured and so we can build our team exponentially faster which means that we will produce exponentially more open source content more quickly, more efficiently, more effectively as we build our team and bring on more and more people to help out with it. So if you're somebody that knows somebody, if you're somebody that's connected to someone, or if you are that individual or that small group that could possibly help us out with the funding, we would definitely like to speak to you. And of course, we are also hugely grateful for all the small donations that we receive. You know, the little donations that we get, $5 here, $10 here, $50 here, all of those small donations help to pay for our internet expenses and the little things that keep us going and, uh, and fund the foundations of one community. Like I said, none of us are paid, so all of those little donations make a big difference as well because it helps us keep everything operating. So with that, I will say thank you as always for everybody that's followed our progress. And uh, if you're interested in, in an update, every time one of these updates comes out, send an email to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com. We'll put you on our newsletter list. Or, of course, you can subscribe to this channel, and uh, that's a great way to get our updates as well. And until next week, we will keep on keeping on. Thanks for following our progress.